and gentlemen, the governor. Hey, hello there, everybody. I'm walking in our pet starters. <laughs> Welcome John, Robert, Catherine, thank you for all your hard work and efforts, uh, most especially here for the parents and most especially for those that are enrolled, our students, our future, and here for Head Start. And I was doing a little bit of research on, on, on really the Head Start program, and really what, that's what it is, it's about a Head Start, Head Start in life. Uh, some of the information that's come to me is, and it's an important fact, that studies have shown that uh, if, if our young students, our kids can read by third grade, and they, they have this been set up for their college degree. I mean, the evidence shows that early learning, uh, and again, those skills that are available for reading by third grade have set up our young children uh, for success in post-secondary education as well. Uh, I want to congratulate my wife, who's not able to be here because she's part of the Early Learning Council, uh, but uh, all those that are involved with the development uh, of our children so that they can reach their full potential. Uh, all of you here for the parents, and all the studies also show that, that those parents that are involved in the, in the Head Start program, uh, history shows that they continue on to a much greater degree than other parents in the involvement uh, with the education uh, of their kids. And that's, that's what's so important. And a lot of the issues that we see affecting our island today uh, there are some folks that are stuck in a rut. And one way to get out of that rut is a good education. Uh, and I, to me, that's the best gift a parent can give to their child, a good education. So I want to thank our, our government partners here, all those are, uh, that are, are supporting the Head Start program. I want to thank you parents, because you folks uh, you love your children and you're showing it. Uh, because you want to give them that opportunity to reach their greatest potential. So in behalf of our administration and all those involved, I want to thank you all for being here and I look forward to signing this proclamation uh, for Head Start. Congratulations. Um, look, we just welcome everybody here, especially the parents and children. Uh, when we talk about you know, giving kids a Head Start, this is exactly what we're talking about, involving the proclamation will say is the nutritional, the emotional, the, the educational supports that wrap around the child and help that child get ready to start kindergarten, ready to learn. Because the governor is right, if you invest in our kids and make sure that they're ready to go to school, it gets them on the right track towards a successful education and a successful life. Uh, when I think about what the Head Start's about, we always, you know, I always think about why don't we do Head Start throughout K to 12 because really what a key component is, is the parental involvement and the, the, the involvement of the caregivers. And so what you're doing today to create a foundation for your children in terms of your involvement, it's not very easy, but that involvement, that volunteering, um, if that continues through your child's life, I mean, we're even more set up for success for, for, our, for our children and for our island's future. So really thank you for your, your involvement and your participation in this program and uh, obviously your participation in your child's well-being and future. So thank you very much. Um, I want to thank all of you parents who came all the way from uh, Talafofo, Agate, uh, Santa Rita, uh, Sinahanya, etc. Um, I think one of the most important things that we sometimes forget, but have, has been alluded to, is what Head Start does for families and, and the parents. You're part of Head Start too. It's not just a children's program, it is a family program. And we work hopefully with you to help you also succeed. Um, some of you may have to go back to school to get your GEDs. We're here to help you. Um, and again, keep encouraging you to uh, actively participate in Head Start. This is proclamation number 2013-091. Proclamation October 2013, Head Start Month. Whereas the most critical years of the children's development and early childhood years, parents and caregivers lay the foundation for young children to succeed by providing the essential emotional, nutritional, and educational support as they soak in the world around them. 
The Head Start program changes lives. It helps parents and families provide the support children need to prepare to the lifelong, as lifelong learners. Head Start is a cost-effective, family-focused program that meets the educational needs of low-income children and their families. Head Start recognizes the challenges parents and families face. In a world where the poverty rate continues to grow, Head Start parents build proper foundations for learning and success. The programs engage parents in their children's learning by encouraging parents to volunteer in the Head Start program and in activities. Parents can volunteer to the classroom as classroom assistants, lunchroom, kitchen helpers, custodial assistants, bus attendants, or office helpers. These volunteer positions for many families serve as a formal work experience for parents and are a stepping stone for families to become self-sufficient. The Calvo Tenorio Administration emphasizes early childhood education as an important step for all Guam children. During October, we recognize the Guam Head Start program for providing children the opportunity to get a head start on success. Now, therefore, I, Eddie Bosick Calvo, Imagalahin Guahan, Governor of Guam, by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Organic Act of Guam, as amended, do hereby proclaim October in recognition of Head Start Month. Throughout the rest of this month, I encourage all Guamanians to recognize the importance of the Head Start program uh, in our schools. I urge all parents to qualify for the Head Start program, to take an active role in their children's education, and instill in their children the value of education by giving them the opportunity to excel early in their lives. And this is signed uh, by my hand on the 8th day of October, the year of our Lord, Anno Domini 2013. Signed by Eddie Bazikavu, Imagulahin Guahan, Governor of Guam. One more. One more.